What really matters to me is finding peace and true happiness. What brings me happiness is my family, my friends, and truly being able to wake up and say that I love what I do. Having been in the entertainment industry for 10 years, I've had some incredible moments. But one moment that really stood out was producing my first television production. Um, that really was a moment where the evolution of Mini Flamini from the TV presenter and actress to a creative and a producer um, was showcased. And that, that's a moment that really stood out for me most. My secret to success is doing what you love and working really hard to achieve excellence in that chosen field. I think the importance of choosing your passion is making sure that you develop your craft in the best way possible. Educate yourself, never stop learning, and I think that will be your secret to success too. So many people inspire me. Um, it's everyday people who are living their truth people who've achieved excellence despite the odds that have been put up against them. Um, you know, there's so many women in this country that, you know, have paved the way before I was able to do what I'm able to do. I look at the likes of Basetana Kumalo, Carol Bauer, Connie Ferguson. I mean, these are women who have, you know, created pathways that were never open before for women in entertainment and women in media. They went from being on-air talent to being creators and that inspires me so much. Internationally, I mean, of course, you look at women like Oprah who turned her TV career into a global empire. Um, those are the people that inspire me, people who take the opportunities that have been given and are able to develop it and turn it into something far greater so that the next generation can say, I can. In life, I believe we all make mistakes, but these are not mistakes that I think we should look back and regret. These are mistakes that I think we should start looking at as learning curves. If we don't make mistakes in life, we can't learn from them and we can't become better people. So, you know, off the top of my head, if I think of things that could change, there could be a massive list. But in hindsight, I realized that if I hadn't made those mistakes and if I hadn't made those decisions in my life that I maybe regret, um, I wouldn't be where I am and I wouldn't have developed the career and the personality traits that I need in order to succeed. So if I had to change anything, I wouldn't. My advice to young girls right now is be your own person and don't be afraid to be whoever you want to be. You know, the world likes to put people in boxes and likes to put people in categories. And I believe that we should fight to break those molds and break those boundaries. We should fight to break those molds and break those boundaries. The world is constantly developing and our opportunities are endless. We just need to fight for each other, fight for ourselves and truly do what we want to do. You know, I, I feel like too much, there's too many expectations that are put on, on young girls in terms of what they should do, who they should be, how they should act. And I feel like if you stay true to who you are, the world will be a much better place with you in it. Women's Month means everything to me as a South African. I remember the woman that fought for us, that showed us what we are capable of, that showed us our strength without fear, and made us believe those memorable words that we all should live by, which is what Tinta Bafazi, what Tintin Bogoto. Women's Month means celebrating the essence of what makes us women, what makes us strong, and what makes us fighters in today's world, which we need to be so much more now than we ever have been. I love getting this question because the one person I've always wanted to have dinner with or meet in my life is the one person that I actually got to meet and that is the late Tata Nelson Mandela. Um, I got to pick his brain, I got to speak to him about his journey, his life and he imparted so much wisdom um, in terms of believing yourself, never giving up, perseverance is everything and um, so I can truly say I've met my icon and um, someone that I completely admire and my life is richer for it.